Monday for a release. Just Maddie right now. And y'all, we have been on quite the journey to get Everly's freaking teeth filled. Um, it's been since before December last year, we've just been going from dentist to dentist to dentist to dentist, trying to find the best price, trying to get on insurance, trying to get Everly to drink the stupid medicine. Um, and it's been a journey for sure. So we've went in like multiple different times to get her teeth filled and it's never worked out. There was one point where she was just sick and they couldn't do it. Um, there was another point where she spit out the medicine after like sitting there for two hours trying to get her to drink this oral sedative. She spit it out because it tastes bad. Um, and they got one tooth filled, that's it. Basically we were just going to tons of different dentists and they wanted to do IV or hospital sedation. Hospital sedation with no medical insurance would run me about $3,000 out of pocket. Um, and that would be due at the time of the procedure for the place that we went to that's like, okay, we can do OR sedation. Um, and then IV sedation would run me $1,000, which they could do in like monthly payments. But still, just like if um, we were to be able to get her on Medicaid, which was the goal, but I don't, I don't qualify and we still never found out if her dad qualifies or not. Um, and like a thousand, it would be free with Medicaid and a thousand dollars versus free is a hell of a lot of a difference. And it also would have been like a hundred bucks with insurance, a thousand dollars versus a hundred bucks, hell of a lot of a difference. So it was just hard for me to justify paying that. So we were trying, trying, trying for the insurance stuff. Um, and she was actually supposed to get on her dad's insurance and that's what we were waiting for and then that just ended up not working out and it's just been like this whole stressful thing and now it's to the point where one of her teeth literally need like a root canal basically and it's just like it's been so stressful because it's like hey either just try with the nitrous oxide please for the love of god try with the nitrous oxide or her teeth are going to continue to rot until i come up with the money i don't make money like i used to I'm in college. I pay rent. Like, I can't just drop thousands of dollars at a moment's notice. I, I wish I could. I wish to God I could. But with inflation, like, my savings have just pivoted. I'll be completely real with y'all. Um, but somebody in Everly's family reached out to us. They're like, hey, I work for a dental office. They, they can do Everly's fillings. It's just nitrous. I'm like, oh my God. Thank you, freaking God. Thank you. You're a savior woman. Um, I love you. And it's that's what we're going to do today it's just oh my god i'm just so thankful because this is something insurance will cover and whenever you have somebody coming in saying hey my kid's teeth are about to rot out we don't have medical insurance i before y'all tell me like oh just get medical insurance i applied they quoted me 800 dollars a month that's more than i pay for my car that is more than i pay for my car that's about that's almost as much as i pay in rent now that i split it with my boyfriend just like it's just not accessible for me um but we're finally gonna try to get them filled today and i hope to god it works i just ordered um my starbucks which recently my order has been a trenta iced passion tea um sub water for green tea i'm gonna do my mascara i've got about an hour less than an hour really before i need to go get everly the only reason i really even sent her into school today on a day where she's about to go get fillings is because she's got spring in class pictures today. So I dressed her up all nice and um, sent her to school. And I have to go home and edit. I just hope I can get a video completely edited. I've kind of been slacking, honestly, because um, we just traveled a bunch and then I had an exam literally the day after I got back. I got a 93, I think, on my exam. Um, it was for anatomy and physiology, and then I have midterms this week. <laughs> and, <laughs> God. <laughs> All right, I'm getting my Starbucks. I've started today just like in a pissy mood, because y'all, I already know I'm gonna have to hold this kid down while they do the shots. I already know she's gonna be screaming and she's not gonna listen. I already know, this morning I had to sit on her to brush her teeth. Do I really think she's gonna sit still for the dentist? No. I really hope she does. She did okay at her last appointment, but I already know. 
that today is not gonna be fun. And <laughs> that's the mindset I came into today with, that it's gonna kinda suck. I wish I had a different mindset, but I just cannot to seem to shake this feeling that today is going to suck. Also, I went into my fridge, right? I've been looking forward to this goddamn salad all week, right? Right. I bought arugula because I've been eating the same salad. I went to Slaughter, right? And I bought their dressing, just like a bulk thing of their dressing. And it didn't have the date on it. My boyfriend cleaned out the fridge and I guess he thought it was old because I have a lot of old stuff in the fridge. And um, threw it away. It's not in the fridge. So I'm making some dressing right now so I can still have a salad. The other dressings just don't look as good. So I put like some lemon juice, chives, avocado, olive oil, garlic, and I'm gonna blend it up and try to make some sort of like avocado dressing. Ooh, I should add nutritional yeast. But today's just already just not going how I would like it to go. And I'm trying to like change my attitude into a positive one. Let's be positive. Woo, today's gonna be good. I woke up with a sore throat and just like pissed off at everything. Okay, I added like nutritional yeast, salt and pepper. I'm gonna blend this bad boy up so I can eat some salad about like 30 minutes before I need to go get up early. And I still have to add a whole video. It's in the blender. You ready guys? I don't have the energy to add any more toppings, so this is this is my little lunch. I put like chickpeas in there too. And now I'm going into my little nook. Um hopefully get a video edited. I'm stressing out bad today, y'all. But I'm trying to like ground myself because if I go into this with a bad mindset, it's gonna put Everly in a bad mindset. If mom's stressed out, kid's gonna be stressed out. And I know this, I'm self-aware enough to like realize that. And um, right now, yes, I'm complaining, I'm frustrated. I'm, I'm very frustrated. I'm having a rough morning, um, I'm very stressful. A lot of things in my life right now that I'm trying to juggle, but I mean, it's it really is all mindset. And if I can put myself in a positive place, I really is gonna be in a positive place, and I'm gonna be in a positive place. But it's just gonna be a much better situation for everybody. So, um, I got my anatomy book bound, um, at, like a store, and <laughs> it fell apart recently. So, um, I'm putting it in here because I want to be able to like really bring it with me because it's very important. So I'm putting it all like in a binder right now, all like 800 pages of it. And the funny thing is, it's like, you actually read like a lot of these, especially in my class, in the lab book, there's a lot of shit you need to know in this book. And it's very important to actually be like reading the material, I feel like. So I do read a lot in here. And by the time you're done, you've got like 800 pages worth of knowledge. So it's, it's pretty cool. Okay, so I need to leave in like 30-ish minutes. And my videos won't download to my computer and it's really stressful. And I just wanted to look and see what damage was done because last night I got really hungry. I went in the kitchen, I ate like an entire crumble cookie. It's like what? Like less than half left? <laughs> and that's like an 800 calorie cookie. <laughs> oh well, it was delicious. 100% worth it. Um, anyways, I'm trying to like get everything to work with me, but it's not. <laughs> okay, so I am now at Everly School. I'm gonna go get her. We're running a little bit late. I couldn't finish editing. But I think that's okay because I only have like 30 more minutes of editing to do. I think we're going to be good, but um, I've got like my little positive attitude now. So we're going to be happy and positive and cheery. So I got Miss Girl from school and we are now on our way to the dentist. Get our fillings. How are you feeling, Everly? Yeah. Um, because 
we have to go to the dentist and everything's gonna get fillings in her teeth. I remember I just wanted to say it. Yeah, so we are hey, heading. Hey, um, guys. Um, well, I went to show you my big at the dentist today. I mean, at school today. That was your pose? Oh, that was your pose. That's cute. I like that. Is okay. Legacy. Like a seat at that? That's cute. Okay, well, we are driving to the dentist now, and Everly the is legacy. so... That's cute. And Everly is so excited to go get her teeth hey, filled. Hey, oh. no, we got a Dunkin' after if you're good. We are late, but we're here and we're heading out. That's not an iPad. You just want to see things. Okay, so I'm basically done and fillings weren't today. This was just more of like a consult to schedule everything out. I thought we were going to try to fill some teeth today, but I'm just stupid and I didn't understand. But me and I really are going to go and get some food, but I think we're going to go to Goodwill first because there's like a Goodwill right over here. And um, I wanted to stop by and Everly said she wants to stop by too. So we're gonna go and check out what they have then grab some food super quick. And take a look at the old fish one. Yeah, but who would? Okay, so we are at Truck Yard now, and if you don't know what Truck Yard is, it's kind of like a honky-tonk type thing, and they have, like, a bunch of food trucks. We're going to see what food trucks they have today. Like, during the day, like, it's just, like, food trucks sit outside, chill out. We went there one time, so it's our next time there. It's our tooth time there. It's our tooth time there. Yeah, it's not, like, two, like, kind of like for A second? Two. Your second time? Yeah, second time there. Yep, so we're going to run in really quick. We found some little trinkets at Goodwill. It's so pretty. Oh, this is what I really found. It's like a little unicorn. I'll show you all more in a minute. Okay, so we're here. We're waiting for some food. I got shrimp fries, and I really got a grilled cheese. Okay, so we picked up our food. I really got grilled cheese and I got like some loaded shrimp fries that looked so good. So um, we are currently going to pick up Slate now because I told my mom that i pick him up today. Um, I'll show you all the food in a second. They literally, so it was like basically an order of cheese quesadillas but we got bread instead of um, cheese. So there's still four like slices of grilled cheese. So she basically has two whole grilled cheeses. So we're gonna give one to Slate, I mean. No. No, I want three. Shrimp fries. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, we're heading to get Slate now. Okay, so we got Slate and we dropped them off. Um, the food wasn't that good. <laughs> um, we are on our way to swim lessons right now and Everly's about to get her butt whooped. Um, no, I could literally fall asleep right here right now. I could just, good night. Yeah, um, I'm gonna try to work out a little bit, but like, I used to literally not go to the gym on days where it was like overcast and just super cloudy and dreary because I just I just couldn't really focus on working out. I was just tired and sluggish. And I just feel tired and sluggish again today because it's it's just cloudy and I get really tired when it's cloudy out. But yes, we are going to go to some lessons. Hello, bye. Hello, bye. <laughs> we're at the pool now and Everly is swimming so good. Oh, 
So I really didn't bring her jacket in and they they had this Lululemon scuba jacket in the like the pro shop for a few months now, I think. And um I don't know, since she didn't have her jacket, I felt really bad, so I thought, why not just get her for her for to wear outside in the walk to the car? Not because I've been like eyeing it and I've wanted it for a long time or anything. Never. Isn't it cute though? <laughs> I love it. It's in the color forgot the name but they, it's not like sold in stores right now it was just like oh it's like lifetime. pinkish it is it's pink something i don't remember but I, I like it a lot i'm going home to cook dinner now no no randy is randy's making my mac and cheese and mommy's going to their dinner yeah i'm cooking so two for... cookers yes in in one player for me I'm the player. A release the player. Okay, I'm home now. I love this little jacket. It's really cute. I just blended a bunch of cauliflower up to make like cauliflower rice. I don't know. We're trying. Um, and I'm going to cut some salmon and bake it. Guys, it's Maddie. I've got my retainer in, so I sound weird. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I've really actually swimming like even better now. Um, I'll update y'all in... I think I filmed the vlog that's gonna go up like next week that shows her swimming progress. But she's doing so good. I'm so proud of her. Her swim lesson teacher told us that she's the fastest that she's ever seen a kid progress and she's done this for a long time. So, like she started off the month not even being able to put her face underwater and now she's fully swimming. I'm so proud. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.